For an extended period of time now, the name Tabo Best has been on the lips of so many South Africans for just the wrong reasons. In today's video, another trouble hits Tabo Besta after his legal team withdraws and abandons him completely because of some points that actually happened that are very vital and necessary so make sure you watch this video right up to the end to get the entirety of the information. Before I give you all the details proper, you're welcome to my YouTube channel. Kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel, like this video, drop a comment and hit on to my post notification bell. On April 30th, 2023, South African journalist Chriselda Lewis posted on Twitter about the latest development in the Tabo Besta case. Tabo Besta is a convicted rapist and a claimer of life who escaped from prison and was rearrested in Tanzania along with his lover. Now, according to Lewis, the legal team representing Besta, who was due to go on record and represent him on May 16, 2023, has withdrawn from the case due to the failure to pay legal cost. This means simply that Besta will now have to find a new legal team to represent him in the ongoing legal proceedings which has actually caused shock and alarm on social media and people were doubting where is all the multi-millions that he definitely worked for all those years. Is he definitely broke already? The case of Tabo Besta has been a high profile one in South Africa. Given the nature of the crimes he has convicted of and his subsequent escape from prison. Besta was definitely serving a jail term when he escaped from prison sometime in 2022. He was subsequently rearrested in Tanzania in 2023 along with his lover who was suspected of aiding him in his escape, none other than Dr. Nandipa. This has caused a huge shockwave on social media given to the fact that Dr. Nandipa is highly loved by so many people. I mean, she is a popular socialite, a popular doc who was appreciated all over the place and now on getting involved into this just tarnishes and dirties her image. Besta's case has reignited the debate in South Africa around issues of crime and punishment and the country's criminal justice system as well. Not forgetting the fact that the withdrawal of his legal team adds another twist to the already complex case and raises so many questions about Bester's ability to mount a defense without the assistance of experienced legal counsel. It is very much on still undoubted at this time while Bester was unable to pay his legal costs or what impact this will definitely have in his case. Between the lines, it is likely to delay the legal proceedings followers Besta seeks no representation. Is this just a way to buy more time? Is this just a way to, for Besta to actually gather and rally more funds, rally more people, rally more proofs that are going to set him free? How possible is it for Tabo Besta to actually leave prison, to leave all of this case that is still pending most definitely at the end of the day free like Frida? You all tell me what you think in the comment section because it is very, very complicated as you all have noticed. I love each and every one of you. 